And when we talk about education, there's something that always bears repeating. There is no more honorable profession than being a teacher. You know, none of us would be in this room today if it were not for the extraordinary people who taught us and believed in us years ago. We are blessed to have so many talented teachers across our states, selfless public servants who stay late to make sure our children don't fall behind, who often dig into their own pockets to make sure they have the materials they need to teach our kids. And yet each year there are some who believe the way to build up our schools is to tear down our teachers, trying to cut their pay, reduce their retirement benefits, or threaten their job security. That simply needs to stop. Now, we can all support making smart reforms to our education system, and of course we should hold educators accountable for the important job we entrust them to perform. But instead of attacking public school teachers, we should make it our mission to recruit the best and brightest minds to take on the honorable work of teaching our kids. Okay. And that is exactly what this significant education investment will allow our local districts to do. Now, tonight we are pleased to be jo joined by Tobin Schultz. Ever since he was in ninth grade, Mr. Schultz knew he wanted to be a teacher. And at Joplin High School, he continues to inspire and motivate students each and every day. Last October, Mr. Schultz won the prestigious Milken Family Foundation National Educator Award. We were all inspired by how Joplin, even in its darkest hour, rallied behind its students and its schools. Just this month, 1,400 students in Joplin walked into a three brand new schools, marking another milestone in a remarkable recovery. Mr. Schultz is joined tonight by school principal, Dr. Kerry Chichetta, A plus coordinator, Susan Day, and superintendent, CJ Huff. Please join me in Missouri in thanking Mr. Schultz and all of our teachers for the vital work they do each day. <laughs> 